Hi, this is Geert Jan from the NetBeans team. In this screencast, I want to compare the startup time of NetBeans versus IntelliJ. I've downloaded the Java SE distribution of NetBeans. I've also downloaded the Community Edition of IntelliJ IDEA. Both of these are aimed at the Java SE desktop. They have no Java EE tooling, so Java EE is in this bundle of NetBeans and is in the Ultimate Edition of IntelliJ IDEA. So in the case of NetBeans, it's free. In the case of IntelliJ IDEA, you need to pay for that Ultimate Edition. However, the question is, what about the startup sequence of this Java SE distribution versus the Community Edition of IntelliJ IDEA? We will not compare the cold startup, so not the startup right after you've installed, but we'll compare the startup of your daily development work after installation, after your first startup sequence, the subsequent startup sequences, so after any caching that's been done after the first time. The first time happens once, that's not the important one. The important one are all the startup sequences that you perform after that initial startup sequence. So that's what we're going to look at. Um, and so I've already started up both NetBeans and IntelliJ IDEA before, in both cases, a couple of times before. And um, so we're going to compare the world startup sequences. In other words, whatever they do the first time they start up, they've already done that. We'll start by looking at IntelliJ IDEA. And here is the icon for starting it up. Once we get to the 30 second mark down here, um, as soon as we get there, I will double click on this to start it up. So five, four, three, two, one. There we go. Starts up and it's now five seconds. It's now 10 seconds, 11 seconds, 12 seconds, 13 seconds. Basically 12, 13 seconds is the time it took. That's really awesome for an IDE. 12, 13 seconds. So let's switch from here now to NetBeans. So here's NetBeans. And we'll wait for the next significant moment. Um, we'll wait until 15 past and then we'll start. So five, four, three, two, one, double click. Okay, the timing is going on now. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. It started up in 10, 11 seconds. It's doing a background scanning, which adds a couple of seconds. Maybe 14, 15 seconds versus 12, 13 seconds on IntelliJ IDEA. There's no difference in terms of startup sequence timing between the two. And they're both awesome IDEs. Definitely they're on exactly the same level when it comes to the warm startup sequence after your first startup of the IDEs. That's it. Thanks for watching this screencast.